Okay. So I'm here at uh, Occupy Victoria, day eight. Uh, just taking a look at the pinnacle of power put in place on our legislature, the obelisk, uh, typical symbolism of a place of power, whose power we, uh, I think we all know. Um, there are people down here right now because they're out protesting the control that banks have taken over our society, that they've taken over our governments um, with their their fractional reserve lending, borrowing, mo borrowing and lending money that uh, they don't even have and putting this involuntary debt on our citizens and on our children. We've got no say anymore over who borrows this money, who has to pay it back. And uh, we've got the Occupy Victoria group sitting over here. Uh, they have been engaging with the constabulary, the, the security guards to say of the grounds and they've requested not to be on camera. So we're just going to walk over here filming the legislature while, uh, while we're talking. So this is uh, the group for Occupy Victoria. Um, about one guy here. Why are you here? I'm here because we need to take part in positive change and help make things different in a better direction. We need to do more. Why are you here? I'm here to support our cause in whatever way I can. And when we stand together, we stand strong. I'm here to show people that there is a system that works and it is right here on the lawn of legislature. It's working right now. We're talking to people, we're engaging them one on one. And whether we achieve a consensus or not, we can, we can reach an agreement to disagree under certain circumstances and the messages that we're trying to relay are still getting across to people and resonate. And this is the system that has been working for us. And uh, are you guys here because of the banking system or anything like that? or? Um, I'm not here for any one particular issue. I mean, the banking system is screwed up, and um, it, almost everywhere you look in society, there is always going to be something that, that will be screwed up. But what I'm here is to establish dialogue amongst the people and to sort of work through um, the, the lack of social dis. Uh, uh, the, the, the social disconnect that's taking place with this movement. Um, I'm not here to engage in group thing with a group. Um, I'm here to uh, teach people that individualism is important and we must hold on to that and cherish it. We can't have a computer that tells us all what to do and then forces what that computer says by force. On, on us all. We can't have that. We, we need to have a system where 100% of us establish a consensus on the things that matter and if we don't think that something matters then we don't have to participate in it. I'm just here to okay. Okay. do my part to make sure that people are spreading the right messages and the right message that we've been spreading here is peace love, harmony, um, and listening, listening, actually listening to people and understanding them, giving people a chance to actually talk and engage. That's all that it takes. That is the solution to our problems. And uh, on a personal note, that is the uh, location of a lot of the problems where uh, these guys are engaging in uh, social engineering through force and mandatory compliance um, yeah that's Occupy Victoria day 8 and we're down here uh, we invite you to come down as well October 15th there will be a huge rally here uh, lots of speakers 10 o'clock to 1 o'clock Saturday October 15th we're not letting this movement be hijacked by the globalists for another 
another push, another closer step towards world government, towards world hegemony. There are people that are awake in this movement and are realizing that it is or is possibly been engineered by the globalists, by the engineers. They've created the problems and there's some of us out here that think this could possibly be one of their their engineered solutions. Uh, we are not participating in violence. We are not advocating violence. We're not advocating force. Uh, we are not. We are hoping for a peaceful assembly, without any law breaking, uh, violence, and riots. Uh, I'd like people to be aware that October 15th, hundreds and hundreds of cities are gathering. Do not riot. Do not let them get you in the streets and let them get you violent. These people know how to deal with us once we become violent. Occupy Victoria, October 15th, 2011, 10 a.m. to 1 p.m. Come join us.